Ain't no telling me to watch y'all in my video. What's up, guys? <laughs> the YouTube video? Mm-hmm. Oh. I am beauty. I kind of got it squished up a little bit, but <laughs> she has so soft. So I just washed my hair uh, with all of the products. You can buy it all online on Amazon for just between $28 and $34. What? Right now, y'all, yeah, doing two braids. Let me show you my outfits. Guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and comb all this product into my hair, and sometimes it get tangled really bad in the back, but the product make it super soft, so I do love that, and I like to smooth it down. You guys, this part is so uneven. I am super ashamed. and I wasn't going off a mirror. I just had my phone on the other side. That I'm just looking at how it looks in the camera. All right, you guys. So after I do that, I'm going to go ahead and section off my hair and put it in two parts. Let me just tell y'all this. I am not the best braider, but it is what it is. Wah, 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 I go in using the Jamaican cashew oil. You guys can see that. Put too much in, just mainly in the scalp. And then I put whatever else left on my ends like that. And just push it in. And as you can see, I got a bunch of gray hair. A girl needs to dye her hair so bad, real bad. In my Miami girl voice, real bad. Or should I say my Carisha voice? Cause I love me some Carisha. And one thing I'm learning is that the back again gets super tangled. Again, y'all, I am not the perfect braider. If you're trying to do two braids and you need to watch a tutorial, I would highly recommend how to braid to the scalp because it took your girl some time and I had to watch a ton of videos. So, yeah. And I'm realizing that it just takes a lot and it's especially hard to do when you're braiding your hair on braid hair. Typically, I prefer dry hair because then my hair is stretched. But typically, with my hair being wet, it's not stretched. It's like super curly. So, it's super hard to do. It's not super curly because I do straighten my hair a lot. But it is super thick. So after I'm done, I just like to put both of my hair, both of my sides in two ponytails. And y'all, yeah, that junk is not straight, but hey, I'm gonna make it do what it do. I'm gonna go in with my Echo Gel, you guys. I love this pink Echo Gel. I don't know the exact name, but y'all take a look at it here. Yeah, I like to put just a little bit here at the top and rub it in backwards. I know a lot of people do it forwards. But I love for it to have more of a sleeker look to it. So after I pretty much rub it all into my hair, I go in with my baby hair brush, as you can see. 
I don't use the other side at all for real, but I do use my brush side to go ahead and tame these baby hairs on both sides. One thing I do like about my Echo Gel is that it doesn't make my hair like crest up or get like super white and it is make my baby hair look super natural. So I do like that. Don't come in here naked. I know video. What? Oh. Oh. Alright you guys, so after my hair is done, this is the final look. And I am just out on a day date with my family. Gonna get breakfast and just enjoying our Sunday. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching the video. Stay tuned for the next one.